Fuck you! Uvanian Bata! Fuck you! You made a big mistake going after the hollow. Come on! This is one of my easiest Z! Come on! That's way too! Fuck me! Stop on so too white now! The man you're talking about took me in when I had nowhere else to go. You are no better than you! You can't take those shoes! You fucking pig! Damn you to her! Take it easy! Take it easy! Take it easy! He kept me in there, locked in there, day and night. Beat me, use me. I kiss you, motherfucker. You and your entire goddamn family. He's dead. He's dead. He can't hurt you anymore. It's over. Over? Over. <laughs> this is never going to be over. Pajam! Fucking Haitians. Well, how much is it? A little over two million dollars. <gasps> per split. <laughs> yeah. Holy mother God. Once everything's settled up, I'm calling the man I know, having him bring over three hookers. Boy, ain't All no right. hooker ever stepping foot in this house. You sure? Because two of them are for you. <laughs> I'm gonna be fucking in my new drifter. Well, I'd appreciate that. You know, my entire life, there's always been someone standing over me, telling me where I could go, what I could do, who I could be seen with. This. What you boys did tonight. This changes everything. This isn't just money. It's freedom. Real freedom. There ain't no one standing over me again. <laughs> over any of us. Vouloir c'est pouvoir, eh? Vouloir c'est pouvoir! Well, well, well. Man himself. Look at what I dug up. You mind pouring one more of those? Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> It'll be my pleasure. Judge, he told me ship went sideways during the robbery. Lincoln had to save your ass. You should be damn proud of that, boy. I am, Sal. More than you'll ever know. <coughs> oh, Jesus Christ, that is some down-home hooch right there, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I got a guy outside. Y'all mind if he comes in and packs up my cut? Hey, Not at all. Look at that. Let's see if you can handle this down home hoot. Yeah, I'll just give me some of that. Trying to get some corn whiskey? Make you a man. <laughs> they all the same. <laughs> hey, take the one on the end. It's your cut. Plus what I owe you. Even put in a little extra for your trouble. Couldn't have pulled it off without you, Sammy. Y'all done right by me tonight. Mwah. Mwah. Why don't you get us something off the top shelf? We need to celebrate. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You ain't got to tell me, bud. <laughs> yeah. Hey, fill me up. All right. You know something, Lincoln? You're possibly the baddest motherfucker I ever laid my eyes on. You shouldn't have said no. Where the fuck you think you're going? Stupid fucking niggas. Go on, grab that bag. Let's go. What's up, Nels?
You need, you need to run this through, boy. You think you can come in here and steal my heroin without nobody noticing? I'm not here to steal your heroin, Richie. I'm here to make you pay for what you did to Sammy and Ellis Robinson. I didn't have nothing to do with it! I watched you stab Ellis in the gut. I couldn't do nothing about it then, but I sure as hell can now. Oh, God damn it. None of that was my idea, you hear? It was all Georgie, him and his old man. They wanted y'all gone, not me. Uh, what was I supposed to do, say no? Either that or make sure that I was dead. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> no, please, please. Listen, listen, just... It's decent thing it'd be to let a man get in a prayer before you kill him. You can pray on the way up. Greco's in that building at the end of the block. A lot of whoas in there. He's probably face down a pussy right now. You got any muscle with him? Yeah, a couple of meatheads. I'll go around the front, you take the back. He tries to run, grab his ass. Nobody kills that prick but me. Fuck. Those are Marcano's guys. God, suck Look, I'm back to the car, you drive, I'll cover us. Fuck if that little prick gets away. God damn it! The fuck are you? Let's get him the fuck out of here. The cops are closing in. Hey, get the door. Yeah. Come on. Please! I didn't do nothing. You didn't do nothing. You were getting ready to fucking kill me. I was just doing what Uncle Sal told me to do. Ah, that fuck never liked me. I get it. But this? You never tried anything like this before. I don't... I don't... Come on, Mikey. Why do you want me gone all of a sudden? He said you were a carpet bagger. Never should have been down here in the first place. <laughs> you want me to keep going? You got nine more! Listen, Jesus, he was worried to know about the casino. And so we're gonna play up to Leo and the commission. What casino? Answer the question. Uncle Sal, he's... You, you, you see that construction across the lake? He's building a casino over there. He wants to go legit. Turn this city into Las Vegas. Gambling's illegal. Uh, yeah, no shit, it's illegal. Uh, which is why he's paid a bunch of money to get the lost chain. Who else is involved in this? I don't know. Uh, I don't know, I swear it! <laughs> Look, I... I told you what you wanted to know. You could have let me go now, right? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I'll clean this mess up. No reason for you to stick around. Remember our deal. I'm expecting to cut of everything you bring in. Hey, I know how this shit works. You'll get your money. There's a woman named Alma. Helps me out sometimes. Cuban. Mean as fuck. You should talk to her, see if she needs anything. Might be an easy way to bring in some extra money. Where's she at? At the warehouse. All right. What are you gonna do with him? Fish gotta eat like everyone else. Our way of doing things won't work in a world like that. Yeah. You come to me with something like this, Lou, you better be goddamn sure. Yeah. Lincoln Clay is still alive. Fuck me. Shit. 
Should have saved a bullet or two. The Negra and the Mech working together. Fuck me. I never thought I'd live to see the day. What can I say? Brave new world. Shall I leave then? I see the legs still giving you fits, huh, fucko? Oh, fuck you. You won't be so cocky once I take the acetylene to you. Fuck you! What do you think happens next, huh? You're gonna die, motherfucker. You're gonna hold next to me. You, your whole organization. You're gonna suck my dick in hell. You all right? Grab his legs. Time to get him into the garage. Fat cunt. I didn't know you was coming. I'm just packing away your latest shipment. How long have you been running this business, Joe? <laughs> I, I, I don't know, five, six years? Five years, three months, and 18 days. Well, this is turned. Look, I, I know I've been lied, but it ain't my fault. I've always placed a premium on maintaining order. If you let the rot set in, Eventually, it will take hold and destroy everything you've built. The only solution is to isolate it, eradicate it before it takes hold. You understand, Joe? Christ, Donnie, you gotta listen to me. Some nuts out there shooting hell out of everything. You know how many of my men he killed? Yes. Dominic, is it? You will take the armored car and personally oversee the collection of all outstanding monies owed to us. Am I clear on this? Y yes, Mr. Razio. Once you have collected what is due, deliver it directly to me at the hotel. The code to the elevator is 0451. You really think you know how all this is going to play out, don't you? <laughs> Idiot! <laughs> Go ahead. <coughs> Kill me. I'll be replaced tomorrow. No one will even notice. You're wrong. Everyone will notice. War on the streets of our fair city is a gunman stormed the Royal Hotel, killing an untold number of men. There was a loud crash, like a bomb going off. I looked up, and there was a man falling from the top of the building. Then all these men showed up, and every one of them had a gun. They ran into the Royal, and that's when the shooting started. I never did anything to you. It's all some interesting stuff back there. Counterfeit money, a press. Only thing I can't figure out is a connection to Cuba. Please. I'm all busted up inside. I need a doctor. I got a wife and three little girls. Hey, you want a doctor? Then you better tell me something worth hearing. Listen. What you saw. Sal set all that up. None of the money was worth a shit, though. Had me bring in a man. Named Alvarez, counterfeiter who works for Castro. He give you the plates, too? Plates? I thought you knew. On account of robbery. Robbery? <laughs> Mulcahy wanted the plates from the Federal Reserve. How do I find Alvarez? Uh, how? Well, one of Tommy's guys picked him up. It was 10, 15 minutes before you showed up. Where are they taking him? Uh, Where? Huh? My little girls. No, 
Frisco Fields is one of the city's most prominent citizens, Remy Duval, was savagely murdered. Witnesses report he was bound to a cross and set on fire. Let's see if we can get a statement from the police. Chief Wilson, you care to make a comment? It's those goddamn nickels. Every last one of them needs to be rounded up and shot. That's quite a statement, Chief. You need to wipe the shit out of your eyes, son. Take a look around. There's a goddamn war going on! never thought you get shot precisely the first time i saw lucio he looked so handsome dashing even he wore the finest suits drove the best cars there was always something terribly romantic about all of this. <gasps> Ain't nothing romantic about robbing and killing people. Maybe not. But it certainly was Where's the Garmo? The Garmo. They have me out in a building. Down by the water. Thought you were gonna kill me. You ain't worth the trouble. Good morning, Ms. Marcano. I'm here with your breakfast. Let's freshen this room up. Get some of that sunlight in here. That's better. Who'd you send? Oh, I did it myself. Yeah, to ear. Just like you wanted. Any sign of the gummo? You're gone. I look everywhere. It's like he never even fucking existed. Well, this is a goddamn mess if ever I saw one. Between Duval's will and his fucking Lincoln Clay, it seems this shit's never gonna end. At least we don't have to cut Duval in on the action anymore. <laughs> you trying to be funny? <clears throat> the Gamo's lawyer is gonna keep this tied up in court for years. I ain't got that kind of time, you understand? Or money. There's got to be someone we can get to. Force them to make this right. That takes a lot of pull. Pull we ain't got. Could always call Leo Galante, ask him. Fuck him! The whole reason I'm building this goddamn casino is to get out from under them worthless fucks. Not bringing the commission. They're gonna wanna cut everything. You must think I'm some kind of goddamn moron coming in here like you did. I've never been one to shy away from a calculated risk. Maybe you should have. I'll mix some vegetable oil in it. Makes the gasoline thick, sticky. We just gonna let it soak in a little bit. Work his way into every nook and cranny. That way when I light it, that shit's gonna burn like napalm.
So that's that, then. Sure looks that way. You know, Sal wanted me to go to law school. Wait for some big company. Maybe run for office. Do something decent with your goddamn life, you understand? Should've listened to him. It's in the blood, you know. Yeah. You are who you are. No point in arguing with yourself about it. Fuck you. I understand you supplied the heroin Georgia was selling. See? Si. Certo. I never wanted that in my city. Shit like that fucks with people's heads. Makes them crazy. Stupid. Brings down too much heat. Bourbon? No. I do not drink. George, you tell you why I wanted to meet. You said the nigger killed your brother? That you wanted to discuss a deal between the two of us? My brother Tommy was a smart kid. He could have been anything. I tried to tell him to go to college, even offered to pay for it. I apologize for your loss. I'm building a casino across the lake. I had it all worked out, including how I was going to pay for it. Now it's all a goddamn mess. <laughs> you want my money. Well, I'm going to need enough to finish the construction. It ain't going to be cheap. I want to hear you say it. Say what? That you want my money. Say those words. Please. I want your money. This is good. <laughs> then I will bring you the money, and in exchange, you will let me sell heroin in your city, and you will not interfere in any way. Sure. Whatever you want. But that's not the only and reason. And you wish me to kill the nigger. Hmm? I will do that for you as well. I enjoy killing the niggers. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You, you must be the nigger. <laughs> My name is Lincoln Clay, motherfucker. Nigger? Lincoln Clay? These things mean the same thing. I give a shit about some politicians. Please, please, I, I don't even know what's going on.
Solo. Listen, I got money. You can have it. All of it. Just don't kill me. I don't want your money. I want you to send a message to your brother. Yeah. Anything. Oh, just say it. Just say it. <laughs> Lord Almighty. State Senator Walter Jacobs was killed this evening in a fiery explosion aboard a riverboat. Local businessman Louis Marcano also lost his life, along with dozens of other wealthy donors there to attend a political fundraiser. Goddamn motherfucking piece of shit! Lou's dead. They found him tied to that statue of Jackson over in the French ward. He was gutted like a goddamn catfish. Jesus fucking Christ. This was that goddamn nigga Lincoln Clay. We would not be in this fucking mess if you'd done what you were supposed to do. You were there. I shot him right in the fucking head. How once! You shot him once! I am leveraged out the ass! Called in every favor, and none of it made a goddamn difference. We're fucked. I am fucked. Oh, now that's bullshit. We still got some men. I say we hit the streets and we found that cocksucker. Every low life ball of piss in this city smells blood in the water. My blood. Do you understand? And they'd step over their own mother if it meant being the one that clipped me. I wouldn't last 10 fucking minutes out there. That's a crock of shit. You forget? You are Sal Marcano. Well, there's got to be something we can do. Or whatever men we still have left. You're telling me to stop there at the casino. And when Lincoln Clay shows up, we're gonna do everything we can to plant that goddamn nigga in the ground. Right next to us. That's what we can do. Go on, get the fuck out of here. Go! Ah! You stupid motherfucker. Oh. I always thought you were my friend. That you had me and Ellis's backs. It was just an act. You didn't kill me because I said no. You killed me because you thought you owned me. Owned all of us. It was never about us. It was about my old man. My father. I did anything for him. Same as you and Sammy. Then you understand why I have to do this. Hell of a sight, ain't it? You know, when I first come to this town, it was nothing more than a backwater shithole. Now look at it. Let me see your hands. Whatever was between us is over, you understand? It ended the second it was you coming up them stairs instead of my son. You want a drink? All right. I had this imported from Scotland. <laughs> Single malt. Now, usually I'm a bourbon man, but I figured I'd order something with a little more class for when the casino opened. Not much of a chance of that happening now, is it? Don't look that way. Take a seat. I ain't going nowhere. Hey, not bad. 
think I still prefer Shine. You know, a month or so after my brother Lucho died, I started having nightmares. I had this one where I was on a boat. A giant wave come, knocked my ass overboard. I hit that water and sink like a goddamn rock. And there was another one where cotton mouths biting me all to hell. But the one that really got to me was Georgie's funeral. He's laid out in that shitty little casket. Neck cut, same as Lucho's. Yeah, that one really got to me. It'll come around again every three or four days. I have one where I'm back in Nam, sleeping in a foxhole. All of a sudden, these dark figures come out of the shadows. I try to fight them off, but they hold me down, tie my hands together, stuff a muddy rag in my mouth so I can't scream, can't warn the men sleeping next to me. And then I gotta listen as all those men die. Imagine that's not gonna go away anytime soon. No. I imagine it won't. And then this. This was all to try to keep mine from coming true. Look how that turned out. I buried a lot of people. More than I can count. The one I never wanted to see go down in that cold ground was my son. And yet here we are. Yes. Here we are. My son is dead. And I'm having a drink with his killer. I'm not gonna apologize for what I did, you understand? If I did, I'd just be lying. I don't have it in me to feel shame for the things I've done to others. Never have. Didn't come here for an apology. Nah. I know you did. Goddamn, I was right about you, wasn't I? <laughs> Knew it the second I fucking saw you at the country club. Men like us, we're just wired up wrong. There's only one thing we know. One thing we're good at. I'm gonna be waiting for you, Lincoln Clay. This won't be the last time we see each other. I know. Four. Fucking... Take it, you're Lincoln Clay. So they tell me. Mm. Yeah. I told Sal this fucking casino would be the end of him. I meant it figuratively. This shit has a way of turning on you, doesn't it? Especially if you piss off the wrong person. <laughs> you know who I am, son? Guessing you're Leo Galanti. Take a little walk, you and me. Probably no surprise, but 
rest of the commission wants you dead. You and anybody else that had anything to do with this. What happened here was between me and Marcano. Well, I understand that, son. We all do. But this business makes you paranoid, irrational. They see Sally in a pile of shit. They start wondering if someone's gonna serve them a plate of their own. So you're here to decide if you're coming after me? No. I'm here to deliver a message. You made your point, son. This all ends right here. Right now. I got no quarrel with y'all. Once a month, Sal kicked up 20% of his net cash only. Same man's been delivering it for, oh, I don't know, 40 years or so. I see no need in deviating from that, do you? No, sir. Well, in exchange, you run things as you see fit. Want to sell heroin, want a whorehouse on every other corner? Makes no fucking difference to me. The only thing that matters is 20%. And what if I decide to walk away? And leave all this behind? Then this will be the last time we see each other. Best of luck to you, son. then and there that I couldn't let that stand. That I would find a way to make it right no matter how long it took. What a